A shocking discovery in East Harlem. The body of a woman found in the trash compactor room of an apartment building. And tonight, cops say no obvious signs of foul play. So what happened? Eyewitness News reporter Tom Negevin found several other concerning details. NYPD crime scene investigators spent much of the day at the East Harlem building, leaving with several bags of evidence. The woman, believed to be in her 30s, found without any clothes on around 9 this morning by a resident dropping off trash in a second floor compactor room. Cheryl Legault is still getting over it. It's bad, it's bad. You know, it's not a good thing to see, you know, a dead person. It's a horrible discovery residents have a lot of questions about, but not a lot of surprise. They say security has long been an issue at this Section 8 building, and people are in and out of here at all hours of the day and night. It's always been an issue here. You know, uh, they, they got these people in and out of here, running in and out of here all day long. Jim Raddy's lived here for 40 years. He says they've got good management, but big problems. <laughs> He's working to get better security. There's drugs all over the building. You know, the people sleeping in the building. The people who don't get in the shelter automatically, um, this is like shelter number two. On the second floor, Cheryl, coming to terms with what she saw, says her heart goes out to a woman she never knew. Just laying right on the floor. I'm so sorry you had to discover that today. I'm sorry for her. Police have wrapped up their work at the scene, but the investigation's ongoing. The medical examiner will determine the cause of death. In East Harlem, Tom Negevin, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.